did you know these automation modes? Read mode plays back the existing automation on a track. For example, if volume data exists, the volume fader will follow it during playback, but moving the fader will not change the existing automation. Touch mode plays back automation in the same way as read mode, but moving controls during playback will change the value of the related automation parameter. After the fader or knob is released, the parameter follows the existing automation. Latch works like touch mode, but after the fader or knob is released, the new parameter value replaces existing automation on the track. Write mode erases existing automation on the track as the playhead passes over it, records new control movements, or deletes the existing data if you do nothing. Trim adjusts the existing automation by the amount you move the fader or control. It can work in combination with touch and latch automation modes. Relative mode adds a second automation curve that offsets the existing main curve for the selected parameter. This only works for volume, pan, and send levels. When both automation curves exist for one of these parameters, both of them are visible and can be edited separately. Relative automation mode can work in combination with touch, latch, and write automation modes. Now you know.